What's up everyone and welcome to the club. In today's video, we're drawing the new Beast Boy skin from Fortnite. Let's begin by drawing a circle on the left side of our page for the eye. Starting from the very top, it's gonna work our way down toward the bottom of the eye, and then back up towards the top. And then we'll add a small highlight circle on the top left side of the eye. Starting from the edge, come all the way in, and then bend that out. Now we want to draw another circle in the center of the eye for the pupil. Let's tuck this in underneath the highlight, starting from the bottom, come around, and then back out, and we'll fill the center of the pupil in black. Now we're going to move over and close the right eye. It's going to line up the center over on the right side, draw a curve going up, and then bending that out, and then we'll add a fold on the inside, stepping up down and then out. Let's move to the center and draw on the nose. We're going to start over on the left, draw a curve coming down and then up. And we'll step up and draw a short curve going up and then down for the bridge of the nose. Now I'm going to move down and draw the top edge of the mouth. Starting back over on the left, curve the mouth coming down and then up. And then on the left side, step in, draw the bottom of the mouth coming down and then just tucking that up on the right. Let's add the lower lip. Stepping down in the middle, draw a short curve. Let's go back up to the top and draw on the eyebrows. Starting on the outside, curve the eyebrow going up, and then down on the inside. Line this up on the right, and do the same thing. Let's flatten off the inside of the eyebrow with a short angle line. And then we'll thicken up the eyebrows. Starting back on the outside, we're just going to taper this up and then in towards the inside. Let's fill the eyebrows in black. Now that we've drawn in the face, let's move out to the side and draw the lower half of the head. From the outside of the left eye, we step out and draw a large half circle. We're going to bring this down underneath the mouth in the middle. We'll round up the chin, pull that out and back up on the right. I'm going to go back to the left side and draw the inside edge of the hairline. Going straight up and then bending that in. Now I'm going to layer some hair coming down across the right side. Starting on the side of the head, go up and bend that in. Let's add a point. Coming in and then down. And taper that back up. Let's add another point. Coming down and then in. And just taper that back up towards the outside towards the same height. Now we want to pull the hairline coming in and then down in the center. Let's start on the left. Coming straight in and then bending that down. Go up and out towards the right. Let's move out to the side of the head and draw on the ears. We start on the left side, angle this up and out, and line this up on the right. And then we'll round out the outside of the ear, starting back on the left, bend this out, down, and then in. Now we want to add some folds inside the ear. From the top, we'll step down, curve up, and then out. Go back to the inside, curve this out, and then hook that in. Now we're going to go back up to the top and add in the hair. Starting from that center point, we're going to curve this out, and then bend that up towards the top. Now we want to bring this back down and around towards its bottom point on the right. So start at the top. Start by coming down, bending that out. Just going to round this out and then pull that down. Then going back up to the top, we're going to step down, put this out and then up. And we'll bring this down towards the left side. Going out, down, and then in. And then we'll layer the hair coming down along the left side. Start from the top left, go out down and then in. And then from here we'll step up, bend this up 
and out. And it'll curve this back in and then down on top of the ear. Let's add another point along the right side. Start from here, just gonna bend this out and bend that back in. I'm just gonna curl this back up towards the top and then we'll tuck this down and then in behind. Let's add a point on the right side. Starting from the bottom, go out and then up. Take this down and back in. I just wanna bring this down on top of the right ear. Bend this out, down, and then in. Now we're gonna move down and draw on the side of the body. Let's start all the way over on the left side, underneath the head, curve the body going out, and then down towards the hip. Line this up on the right, going out, and then down towards the same height. Let's line up with the hips in the center and draw in a circle. Starting from the top, go all the way around, and then back up, and I'll trace that circle along the inside. Let's draw the bottom edge of the belt in behind the buckle. Starting on the left, come down, and then in. Go back to the left side, step up, and draw that same curve coming in towards the side of the buckle. And then we'll add a belt loop on either side. On the left, draw two straight lines coming down, and the same thing on the right. Let's go back to the center, step down and add a curve from left to right, going up and then down. And then leaving a small gap in the center, let's go to the left side, curve the leg going out and down towards the left heel. Move over towards the right, go out and down towards the right heel. Now you want to round out the bottom of the feet. Let's start from the left heel, we're going to curve the foot coming down and then up towards the toe. And then we'll go back to the left side and round out the top of the foot. Starting on the outside, we're going to curve this up and we'll just bend this down aiming towards the heel, leaving a gap on the inside. Now you want to draw the outside of the boot. From the top of the foot, let's step out, draw a straight line going up on either side. And then we'll curve the edge of the boot, going down and then in. Let's go back up to the hips and draw the side of the leg coming down in behind the boot. We're going to start on the left side, curve this out, and leave a little overlap on the outside. and then we'll wrap the boot in behind the side of the leg. Start from this point, put this up and in. Let's go back to the top of the foot and draw two straight lines coming down side by side. And we'll do the same thing on the right. I'm also gonna add a thick sole along the bottom of the feet. Let's start on the left side, step up, just follow that same curve of the foot, coming in towards the heel, from heel to toe. Now let's separate the bottom edge of the pant. Starting from the side of the leg, curve this down and back up on the inside, and then line this up on the right. Let's step up and do that again. Now we're going to move back up and draw the arms pointing out towards the side. Let's start underneath the head on the left, curve the arm coming down, and then out towards the wrist, line this up on the right, and do the same thing. Now from the wrist, we're gonna point the thumbs going up. Let's start on the left, curve this out, and then up. And we'll bend the outside of the thumb, going out, and then back in. Now we're gonna straighten out the first finger. From the outside of the thumb, go out, and then bend that down. Go back to the tip, come down, and then in. Let's fold two fingers underneath. Starting from the bottom of that finger, draw an oval. Going out, in, and then back up towards the top. And then from the outside along the bottom, draw that again. Going around, and just tuck that up underneath. Let's go back down to the bottom of the last finger, curve the hand coming down, 
I'm just gonna bend that up and do the same thing on the right. We're also gonna add the inside edge of the palm. Starting from the bottom of the thumb, come down and hook that in. Now let's close off the bottom of the arm. For the inside of the palm, we'll step down, come straight in, and then bend that up in behind the body. Let's line this up on the right. Coming down, and then out. Let's go halfway along the top edge of the arm and draw on the sleeve. We'll cut this in, and then back out. And now we're gonna add that trim inside the body. Let's start on the left side, come in, bend this around the body, and then come down in an angle towards the top of the belt. Let's do the same thing on the right. Come straight in, around the top of the body, and then angle is down and in. And then we'll trace these curves along the inside. On the left, step up, let's follow that same curve coming around, and then all the way down towards the bottom. Same thing on the right, going up, and then that out. And that's pretty much it. There's the Beast Boy skin from Fortnite. I hope you enjoyed today's lesson. Make sure you subscribe and check out our Fortnite playlist. We're adding new characters every week. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you again soon.